I am so passionate about sharing my story and just in hopes of inspiring you all to just, you know, go on the journey of taking care of yourself, loving your body and just respecting your time and just taking care of yourself. I think in 2019, so many teenagers are just like, and I graduated five years ago, so I know how it is. I was stressed out, overwhelmed, and I was just all the time like, <laughs> um, and I think it's just so important just to take care of yourself and to start as young as you can because throughout your whole life, you know, things are going to change. You're going to get jobs and go to college and like boyfriend, girlfriend, friends and trying to balance it all and staying healthy and, and doing things for yourself. It can feel overwhelming, but I think when you take like 10 minutes, 30 minutes, an hour every single day for yourself, it just gets better and you start getting in the habit of like right when you wake up and before you go to bed, how do I want to start and end my day? Like, do I want to take care of myself? Do I want to start kind of meditating? Do I want to start reading? Do I want to start a new hobby? Like whatever it is, it's just so important just to kind of like trust your gut feelings about, I want to start taking care of myself. Maybe I don't want to start, you know, drinking a lot of caffeine or Red Bulls, or maybe I don't want to go to bed at 3 a.m. Maybe I want to like get more sleep. And I think it always feels great because I was such an overthinker. It took a lot of years of therapy, of meditation, of exercising, and having a great friend group and an awesome family to really want to check in with myself and to be like, well, what makes me feel good? Like I have to take care of myself before I help other people. Um, and you guys are all seniors, yes? Okay, so I fully get how that feels. I mean, you're literally like <laughs> about to take that leap off and you're like, oh my gosh like it's it's scary it's overwhelming it's you're about to be an adult it's some of you are moving out some of you are going to college some of you are going to a community college some of you are going straight into working and getting a job and whatever it is i just want to say i commend you all so much and i have so much respect for you all because i fully get what it feels like i did one year of community college and i did not like it so i left and i started my own business because that made me happy and i believe academics is wonderful but i also believe that there are many different paths in life that you can take i think everyone has their own zone of genius whether that's like playing sports or acting or making music or singing or making clothes and designing just whatever like lights up your soul it just, it's so worth it to trust that and to just make yourself happy and to put your well being and your passions first because I do believe that everything else falls into place. And it's just, when you put yourself first,